Well, tonight, in remarks that could trigger a political storm in the coming days, businessman Narendra Raval has expressed his wishes for President William Ruto to be in office for at least 25 years. The remark touches on the sensitive question of presidential term limit that have been in force in Kenya for 30 years now. Now, his comments renewing similar calls on a core constitutional subject since President Ruto's administration came to office could prompt a debate on an issue granted constitutional guarantee. Here is Ayub Abdikadir with more. It was in the remote interior of West Pokot County that affluent businessman Narendra Raval hosted President William Ruto for the opening of Klinka Cement Factory. In his welcoming remarks, Raval poured praise on President William Ruto in colorful prose that spilled over into a rather controversial constitutional space. Raisi yetu iko hapa na iko na furaha. Liko anashindwa na hiyo weather lakini mzee kushajaribu sababu ya nini kukuja hapa hata na barabara. He loves us so much, he loves this country so much that especially myself, I have no words to say thank you to him. God gives him 100 years of life. I wish that we have this president for at least for 25 years. He, no, Mali Angidi iko meka mingi sana. So if we have this Ichi Tabadlisa. Presidential term limits in Kenya are a controversial subject, with the struggle for reforms in Kenya for decades revolving around the quest to introduce term limits for the president, a struggle that bore fruit in 1991 when the contentious Section 2A of then Constitution was repealed, paving the way for the reintroduction of multi-party system of governance in 1992. Subsequent pre-election reforms introduced a two five-year term limit for the president, a practice that has been there for the last 30 years. But in a remark that could well be inadvertent, businessman Raval appears to have triggered a constitutional quarrel, a sentiment that got an immediate backing from lawmaker David Kosing. Their remarks rekindling Fafi constituency lawmaker Salah Yaqub's similar remarks in November 2022, calling for the scrapping of presidential term limit, setting an age limit of 75 years. A proposal that fizzled out ever since. Ayub Abdikadir, Citizen TV.